Good morning guys. I am up and awake and it is almost time to work out. I've been up for a while. I've already finished my meditations and manifestations for the day. I do a meditation every morning when I wake up and for me it truly just helps set my mood and my mind for the rest of the day. And even on those days like last week where I wasn't feeling particularly good or particularly successful, even just repeating that stuff over and over again, even if the voice in the back of my head is like, yeah, right, yeah, right, like at least I'm ingraining that practice into my everyday life. And at least I'm trying to, you know, fake it till I make it, <laughs> if you will. So even when I'm not necessarily feeling it, I still do it. And that, it, once again, is another facet of discipline, okay? Doing things that you know are good for you in the long run, even though you don't want to do them in the present, I just spoke to myself right there. But with that being said, I've actually been feeling really great this past week. I've been feeling really positive and my affirmations are just filling me with so much positivity and hope and joy. And you know what else fills me with joy? Zip this. <laughs> and today we are having, is this grape? Oh geez, it's grape. It's everyone's favorite grape. I don't know where my bottle opener is. Mm. Hashtag wax swag. Okay guys, let's get ready to shake it in three, two, one. <laughs> to prosperity, to abundance, to gratitude, and to discipline. Hello. Woo. Okay, great. I see you coming through matching the color of my hair, okay. I see what you on today. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, today's weightlifting. Let's get large. and sit back away from me and sit oh okay sit good boy finally boy there he goes he's such a good boy diddy buds sit diddy diddy sit wag your tail <gasps> good boy good boy you did it today for what i eat wednesday i am having that bake and it wasn't even a bake I, it was just a one pot meal i seasoned the ground beef with garlic and onion and fennel Ooh. and just red pepper flakes and i was just like and who's extra today i was just literally fennel. no extra utensils fennel who is this who's this fennel woman uh, Roshana said the June challenge is going to get us to those mini goals. You are right now. There are so many people signed up on the Nike uh, Run Club app. Richard, are you signed up? I was about to. You got to get on that app. Like, like, okay, so go to the Facebook group and Roshana has so graciously written like all the instructions and there's like pictures and screenshots. And so I've already signed up. We're all friends in the group. We're already all on the, the Run Club app. Uh, and so we are getting started in June, and it's to do at least 75 miles. You can do more than that. You can add on some other uh, goals as well, like mine's going to be to track every day and to uh, drink 64 ounces of water every day nice. and 75 miles. But, yeah, we're just, you know, we're walking. Hey, guys, I just finished the live. Today I am repping Lakanto. I got this shirt once again for free from KetoCon last year, and this is the first time I'm wearing it. I got it literally a year ago. The first time I'm wearing it, don't forget, you can get 15% off your Lakanto purchase by using the code WAC15. I will put it in a link in the description box below. I love their sweetener. I love their chocolate chips. Like I, Lakanto has a whole bunch of stuff now that I honestly haven't tried, but liquid monk fruit, chocolate chips alone, totally worth it. I am starting off the morning with my cello wisps and my whole foods almonds. I've been doing this for like the past month and I really, really like it. I love like a grab and go snack type feel first thing in the morning. So I'm going to have this. Then it's time for my coffee and mi espanol. And then I can't wait to show you my meal prep, like my little one pot wonder. Like it's actually very delicious. And so is this. So I'm going to stop talking 
and start snacking. Thanks. Bye. Okay, guys, this is me committing to you today before God and America that like I'm going to make it a point to drink more water. I say that like every other week and then I just randomly forget because I don't like drinking water, okay? I feel like I should, but I don't like it. So this is me saying that before my coffee, I'm gonna have water and I'm, I'm doing that. I'm doing that for myself because I know that water is good for me. I just don't want to. Discipline, okay? There my husband goes, just out there cutting the grass. Oh, he's coming right at me. Oh no, he's coming right at me. <laughs> oh, that should be riding up on me. <laughs> okay guys, just enjoying my bulletproof coffee. Mmm, same old, same old. Cup of coffee, cup of chocolate almond milk. Two tablespoons heavy whipping cream, some sweetener, one tablespoon of butter, one scoop of that preferred keto chocolate collagen powder. Every single time. Down in the basement, I was about to say lab. You guys, if I was tacky like my sister, I'd be like, down in the lab, hashtag grind season, hashtag rah, I don't know. I, either way, I'm down here in the studio in the studio i'm done okay i'm down here in the basement let's just call it a basement what it is doing some work i got a custom tank going out to linda today linda this is all yours and it looks amazing it's the hashtag whack logo with a custom you got this underneath if you didn't know you had it guess what you do okay you got this all right like i am so excited to get this out to you don't forget if you want to order a shirt you can go to www.watchautumnketo.com slash swag. I have a store. It's a little waywardly organized, but regardless, you can purchase anything and then write some details in the comments and I'll be able to make any custom shirt for you. Okay guys, we are back from running errands. I am home holding this bowl in my hand with a towel because I just took it out of the microwave and it is super hot. This is my meal prep for the day. It's like super simple one bowl meal normally i have like a big tray with a bunch of different components but no this is just eight ounces of ground beef with like two cups of broccoli and some rails tomato sauce and it just looks so plain i'm not even gonna say it looks good i mean it looks good here i don't know if i'm translating that to the screen but like it just looks hearty i can definitely say that hearty and filling and delicious now, as a lot of people comment, you can very well put cheese on this and it could be like some sort of Italian bake and whatnot. And I'm totally fine with that, but it's also just really good as is. It's a really simple, clear flavor. I'm going to try this big piece of broccoli right here. Yeah, absolutely. If you like broccoli, if you like beef, if you like marinara sauce, I say go for it. This is great. I'm going to have this. Oh. This is my second of three 20 ounce glasses of water that I'm committing to for the day. So I'm going to drink this with my lunch and then I'm going to have another one with dessert and then I'm going to be done and I'm not going to have nothing to say about it. Okay. So I'm going to watch some television. Don't know what's on the DVR if there's anything left. I finished up The Masked Singer last night. That was kind of the first time where the winner, I didn't know who it was. I pretty much knew who everyone else was, but I was like, who is actually the person that won? Not surprised, not disappointed. Like, oh, okay, that's cool. So, don't know what's on. Just also finished Westworld, which just got really weird. Like, comment down below. Do you watch Westworld? What are your thoughts? Like, where are they going with this show? I don't know. So, I'm excited to see what else is on TV. I'm gonna eat this and then I'll be back for dessert. All right, guys, empty bowl, empty cup. You see here, that's two of three. Now, I might as well go ahead and fill up the third one. Ah! Oh. There, I did it. I'm finishing off the day with my cheese and my keto bar and more water. I'm watching The Baker and the Beauty. I don't know if I've talked about this before. It is just the God friended me of the summer. Like it's just plot hole after storyline, after shoulder shrug, after question mark. Like why do we care about this is all I wanna know. But for some reason I'm still watching. So do you watch The Baker and the Beauty? What are your thoughts? I mean, it is, I would say feel good TV, but it's mostly just like TV. It's just TV. So I'm watching it. Put some other good shows to watch down in the comments. It can be across any streaming platform. We got them all. I just need something new to watch.
Okay guys, I've wrapped up working for the day, so I'm going to finish it off with the huge Sprite Zero Jello. Once again, I like to start my days the same and end my days the same. Like, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Don't let anyone tell you that eating the same thing is boring, okay? It's whatever works for you. That's all I'm saying. And Sprite and Jello work for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make meal preps on Mondays, What I Eat Wednesdays, and a Freestyle Friday video every week. You can also find me on Facebook, Patreon, and Instagram at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks, and I'll see you next week.